In life, we are always curious as well as amazed by misery. There is always something that we don't quite understand. Even ordinary things that we take for granted like gravity and friction have something to tell us, but we don't usually look deeper at it, and hence we just pass it by. But when we lose the sense of mystery in religion and our faith becomes demystified through rationalism and familiarism, then God would become just a concept. In the first reading, we hear the prophet Jeremiah lamenting of such attitude when he said, The priest asked not, Where is the Lord? Those who dealt with the law knew me not. The shepherd rebelled against me. The prophets prophesied by Baal and went after useless idols. God has become just a thing that existed only in the minds of the people, but not a reality in their hearts. As Jesus would quote the prophet Isaiah in the gospel, Gross is the heart of his people. They will hardly hear with their ears. They have closed their eyes. When you lose the sense of misery, then we also lose touch with the spiritual aspect of our lives. Our hearts would also grow coarse and our lives are like leaky cisterns that hold no water. Therefore, prayer is fundamental and essential in our lives. Prayer softens our hearts and makes us sensitive to the mystery of the presence of God around us and also in us. God has revealed himself to us in the Bible, but God continues to reveal himself to each of us in a personal way. So may our prayer lead us to a deeper encounter of the mystery of God in our lives.